Hola, me llamo Robelki, soy estudiante y estoy traduciendo al doctor en Zachary Damages. Welcome to the show. My name is Dr. Damages. We are coming to you from the greatest city in the world. Yes, yes, yes. Merry Christmas to you all. Merry Christmas. Yes, yes. It's Christmas in New York City, and it's always wonderful. Yes. I, I don't know about where you live or where you come from. Yes, now. But Christmas tradition is alive and well in New York City. Yes. It, it's, it's one thing that Donald Trump is not taking away. <laughs> at, at least not now. Yeah. <laughs> not yet. Not yet. No. We don't. Do, we don't do knockout like all the other cities in the world. Uh -huh. I mean, other than the usual knockout that happens every weekend. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No. 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 Every weekend. You know, from the beginning of this year. Like this one. <laughs> I know, I know, I know. Other than that, Christmas is a time when we give to the less privileged mm. among us. You know? Mm. The good book. Compassion. Yeah, compassion. The good book says mm. that it is better to give than to receive. Yay. Although the ultimate book, MMM, mm -hmm. say, <laughs> yeah, that one, that one says that you should give and you receive many faults mm. immediately. Mm. And you can't beat that. You can't beat that. There's no, I mean, you give and you wait till you go to heaven. I mean, who wants that? You give and then three months after you get, <laughs> you get the alert. That's all, you know. Now, some people really want to give, but mm. the challenge is to find the appropriate thing to give. Mm. It's difficult. I've been trying to give things to tomato just You don't know what you want to give to them, you know. For instance, you don't gain anything. No marks are given to you for giving Kim Kardashian a bottom. You know what I mean? She got it already. Mm -hmm. But but if you give Solomon the long, you know him, the yeah, minister yeah, of sports. Yeah, yeah. If you give him a functional yeah. brain, you have given him something. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, functional brain. Now, you haven't given anything. If you give President Robert Mugabe another quote, mm. he has said everything important mm. that anyone said in 2016. Yes. But if you give Dela Momodu a new job, now that John Mahama has lost the presidency in Ghana, ah. you have given well. Yes, you know, I've done well. That you don't well. That's mm. what I'm trying to tell people. Yes. You don't get any favor if mm. you give Linda KG another Range Rover. Ah. But, but if you give El Rufai another Zera, you know, mm. something to look forward to, you have given well. Yeah. <laughs> now, talking about gifts. Season of giving. Yeah, season of giving. For those thinking of giving something to President Muhammad Buhari, mm. you cannot go wrong with any of these three books. Mm. The first book is called uh, We Are All Feminists, with the exception of The Last Man in Daura. Mm. <laughs> that book was written by Chimama Nangozi Adichie. Mm. Excellent book, you know. Mm. If you throw in the house edition of the book, the better. Mm. <laughs> now, another book you can give to Buhari is called The End of Body Language by Bola Tinubu. Hey! This one just came off the press. <laughs> If you pay $19.99, Amazon will deliver it to your doorstep using a drone mm. before Christmas. Yeah. With Prime. Yeah. Now, the number one book you can give to Buhari is for this Christmas. It's called This Nigerian Life Self mm. <laughs> by one Rudolph Okonkwo. I, I, I mean, they said the book is, is kind of opposite of that one that is called uh, This American Life Self. Hey. You know, you can give it to Buhari so that you will understand how Nigerians are feeling. Mm. Now, for Buhari's new in-law, you know his in-law, yeah. uh -huh, the billionaires, you know, I have an Dimis. idea. Adimis, I have an idea for them. Please give Buhari a gift of a fast car, mm. something like Lamborghini. Mm -hmm. You know, any car that will go from zero to 200 miles per hour in, mm. in 60 seconds. Mm -hmm. I know he will not accept it, but just, just take him on a ride in one of those cars. Mm, you know, car. take him there. Afterwards, tell him that this is how the 21st century government is supposed to work. <laughs> Not, not like a 24 wheeler that takes uh, forever to make a U turn. <laughs> no, no, that's the that's goal. That's the goal. No, no. No, I, mean, I mean, why must Buhari wait until the Super Falcons mm. took to the streets to protest mm. before he ordered the payment of the allowances? Why? Your money is not coming in. If he chose a buffoon as Minister of Sports, uh -huh. he has to have the willpower to fire the man or do the job of the man. Uh -huh. Now, that is, that is not all. That is not all. Why is Buhari waiting and waiting and waiting before he does something mm. about the secretary to the federal yeah. government? The yeah. secretary to the federal government, you know the guy? Yes, no. And the head of service, mm. who has become more or less um, <laughs> the head of corruption. Ah. <laughs> I know, I know, I know. What? No, I, okay, I didn't say that. The Senate of Nigeria said it. Mm. They are demanding the resignation and prosecution of the man. Mm. Oh, it's not me, it's the Senate. Wow. And now, now, 
imagine how bad you must be for the Senate, the dean of corruption, to demand your removal. Imagine that. Listen, listen to him. That the presidential initiative on the that is took undue advantage of the provision of the emergency situation contract award in the Procurement Act 2007 to over-inflict contracts. <laughs> I know. In the spirit of giving, I hope that this holiday period, you will make out time to visit the needy. Mm. You should give whatever you have, no matter how small. I'm talking to you. Mm. Whatever. <laughs> when I said the needy, I'm talking about a wide variety of people, mm. from Majek Fashek ah. to a make for, wow. and to all those who participated in MMM. <laughs> By now, you know that MMM scam is over. The participants are now waiting for January to begin to kill themselves. <laughs> oh, yes, I said it, I said it. They, they are in denial, and they need to hear the hard truth. Yes. MMM has a special Christmas gift for all of their Nigerian participants. Mm. And on the package, they wrote, you've been duped. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's coming. The Russian guy, the scammer, who brought it to Nigeria, mm -hmm. was a very kind man. Mm. You know, he said he will let them celebrate Christmas, after which he will break their hearts. Uh, no, no, that's what he said. He said, you know, what a very nice man. What a very nice man. But what? What a nice man. Mm. As of last week, there were three get-rich-quick schemes in Nigeria. Mm. Politics, church, or invest in MMM. <laughs> yeah, one has crashed. We don't know what the next one will be. <laughs> So this Christmas, give according to how much you receive. Mm. If you get 10% of the salaries and income of 1,000 people, mm -hmm. you should open your hand wide and give someone. Mm. Give like someone who got 10% mm. from 1,000 people. Mm. If you don't know how to do it, learn from this man. Watch. <laughs> Oh, yes. He is Prophet Ebelena Chukun, hey! the general overseer of Jehovah the Mightier, hey! All Deliverance Ministry. Ooh, ah, ah. His church is in the Shanambra State. Hey, hey. <laughs> he redefined how men of God who got blessed by their congregation mm. should give back. Mm. Watch, watch him again. <laughs> He's done. I'm telling you, this is done. This is show, hey. show the man again. Wow. The man, his Elias is, is called excess power. Mm. <laughs> they call him excess power. As you can see, he also has excess money. Mm. No, no, Shame. excess money. If, now, if you cannot throw, go through these hassles of picking the money and throwing it at people, then get one of these machines. This one. <laughs> you just, just pray it. Anyway, talking about money, President Muhammadu Buhari of Nigeria presented the 2017 budget. Did you know that? The yes, budget? Yes, yes. Two, and it's of 20, 24 billion dollars. $24 billion. Never in Nigerian history. Yeah, they said it's unprecedented. Hey. Now, <laughs> let me tell you. The state of Colorado in the U.S., uh -huh. they make $1 billion from selling weed. Hey. And, and Nigeria is budgeting mm. uh, 24, is, 24 billion. $1 billion a year hey. selling weed. Wow. And our budget is $24 billion and you are clapping. Hey. Anyway, anyway, after Buhari's speech, Nigerians bounced on him. Hey. Some Nigerians, are, they are so bad. They went through Buhari's speech, budget speech, and they counted the words. They said that the president mentioned oil 21 times. Hey! 21 hey. times. You know that oil is now selling for 50, $58 a barrel. Mm -hmm. $58. And Nigeria's production is back to 1.8 million barrels a day. You know, can you imagine that? The good times are coming back. Yeah, they are coming yeah. back. <laughs> if only uh, Babashia Lawa will stop uh, cutting grasses with 200 million, 200 million naira. That's it. If he could stop, then the good times might come soon. Now, now Buhari mentioned growth 13 times, and he mentioned change six times. Guess what? Corruption has zero mention. <laughs> he did not mention corruption once. Mm. Do you know why? Wow. 
why. Which brings us back to Ababa <laughs> the secretary of the federal government. Hey, the man, you. the man, many weeks ago, I said that this man was a thief. Sorry, ah, who, who wrote this crap? What I said was that this man has questions to answer. Hey! Not that he was a thief. Who is, hey! who is this? Somebody is, somebody is hacking into my stuff. Hey, crack reporter. <laughs> this week, yeah, some crack reporters. This week, the Senate of Nigeria now demanding that the man should resign hey! and should be prosecuted. Yes, yes. They accused the man of having interest in the company Roller Vision mm. that got 250 million naira mm. contract to cut grass around the camp of internally displaced people. Hey! Can you believe that? IDP. Yeah, 200 and something million naira. Wow. wow. Here is Dino, Senator Dino Malaya, breaking it down in the Senate. Hmm. Yeah, Babacha Lawa, the current secretary to the government of the Federation, was awarded. Mr. President, I want you to underline with red barrel your own copy. Awarded. Consultancy contracts for the removal of invasive plant species. <laughs> I know, I know, you know, I'm disappointed in this man. Why is it that our criminals are not even smart? He said he resigned from the company, but he is still signatory to the accounts. And as soon as the Senate started looking into, into the company, he went and removed his name from the company. <laughs> our criminals are not smart. Listen to Dino Moore. Baba Chiyalawa in the fashion of the fastest man in the world <laughs> ran to Corporate Affairs Commission and quickly withdrew his directorship of the company after the execution of the company. Wow. That is Dino opening the stomach of this man. <laughs> I'm, I'm impressed. I mean, this is the senator of the year. Is that not what they gave him? Watch him more. It is on record by this document that as I speak to you, it is still a signatory to the accounts of the company. Mr. President. Mr. <laughs> no, no, no. Dino did not stop there. He put the whole matter in contest because some people don't get a contest. Listen. I've exhibited anti Buhari tendencies. The president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, one of the finest presidents out of the Sahara, not of the Limpopo, will be rolling in his chair now in anger. I know, I know. He said that the president will be rolling on his chair angry <laughs> about the secretary to the federal government and what he did. That's not true. Watch, watch the president and the secretary smiling and laughing. Ah. <laughs> now, the whole thing made me feel like crying. The comedy and the error mm. that we call governance in Africa. Yes. Thank God. Support. Thank God. Thank God I'm not the only one who felt like crying. Mm. Watch. Mr. President. <laughs> yesterday. Yesterday, I felt like crying. But today, Mr. President, I want to cry. I know, I know. I know. Now, now, trust the big mouthed man, uh, Lawal. Mm. He came back, he fired. Mm. He said that the Senate allegation against him that they are absolute nonsense. Business. <laughs> he said they are nonsense. Uh, uh, my man, my man, your response, sir, is absolutely delightful. Mm. I'm impressed. You know, I know, I know that Buhari doesn't want to be pushed and told where to fall. Mm. But on this one, he better fall where Nigerian people are pushing him. <laughs> fall where they are saying you should fall. This is not Namde Kano. This is not Sheikh Ibrahim Zagizaki. Mm -hmm. This is not, this is corruption. Mm. This is your tough, my man. This is what you are known for. Mm. Now, in the spirit, I'm just saying, in the spirit of giving, I have an idea for a cheap Christmas gift Buhari can give, give Nigerians. Very cheap. cheap. Very cheap one. Mm. Fire the secretary to the federal government ah. and the minister of sports. Uh. People will be celebrating. Just yeah. very cheap. Just announce, just a press Christmas statement. Gift. Yeah. Now, talking about Nam Kano, last week, his trial continued. Mm. The government stated that they want to try him in secret. Mm, I know. I, 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 don't, I don't get it. What is the government hiding from us? Yes. That they must try him in secret. Mm. 
what is so dangerous that we must not know? Mm -hmm. Not even in Guantanamo Bay that they try people in secret. Yes, ma'am. Lawyers are allowed to view government evidence. Yes, ma'am. So that they can defend their, their, their yeah, clients. Probably. Yeah. Now, <laughs> when they said that to Namde, you know, he got pissed off. Watch. <laughs> I know, I don't blame him. It is just, is it just me or do you feel that the longer they keep this man in prison, the angrier he becomes? Yes. Anyway, anyway, Namdi said this. Watch. I don't know who I am. I will get in this truck, I will destroy my job completely. I will kill you from the head. Go around, walk ahead. I have to get the other one. Come on, push up. Come on, push up outside. I know, I know, I know, I know. See, only Namdi can do something like that. Mm -hmm. They are saying that they want to try you in secret. And you are insisting that you want an open trial. And then the best way you can make that point clear is to say that that you will reveal secrets mm. that will sink Nigeria. What? Can you imagine that? What, what type of secret is that? <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> they, they're saying that they want to try you in secrets. Uh -huh. and, and you're saying you want it to be in the open. Hey. And to make your case, you're saying that if they put you out there to talk, you will reveal secrets that will sink Nigeria. <laughs> You see, that's why this is this is isn't that wonderful. This is this wonderful. No, only only what? Namde can do only this. In Nigeria. Only in Nigeria. Anyway, back to gifts. You know, for the media, you cannot go wrong if you buy them addition and multiplication table. <laughs> <laughs> you have to do something for the media. You know the tragedy in New York where the other day there are church building that collapsed. Mm -hmm. We don't know how many people died because mm. the Nigerian media could not count. Mm. They couldn't count. Yeah. <laughs> And of course, hey. we don't trust the government emergency agency to give us an accurate account. Hey. Even though people oh, saw, they saw more than six people, six bodies mm. in pictures that were online. Mm. Nema, you know Nema? Mm. Uh -huh. They said that only six people died. Six people died. Hey. The government came out and said, oh, it's about 32 people that died. Hey, how many injured? I, I, we don't know. Though, you know, six people, it, it, six is too much. Mm. Uh, but how did the media get to 200 people? Hmm. Eh? How did they get to how did they get to 200 people? <laughs> this is a question they have to answer. They need an arithmetic book, or maybe they send them to school to learn addition and subtraction. Hmm. Abacus. Yeah. Now, by the way, by the way, what was the result of that uh, Buhari's uh, visit to, to um, Gambia? Hey. <laughs> you, you know that he went <laughs> there to, to, to persuade President Yaya Jame to give up power. What happened? Hey. Africans don't get it. Hmm. If you want to get your jame out of power, there is just one simple thing to do. Mm -hmm. Find him another woman. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 seriously. No, no. You know, you know the governor, former governor of uh, Edo State, uh -huh. eh? uh, Oshomole. Yes. He has this kind of wife mm -hmm. that that jame has. Yes. Have you thought about it? Yeah. Have you seen their wives? You're right, you're right. They look like sisters. <laughs> so maybe we can give him another one. Hey. Say, take this and retire. This mm -hmm. is uh, your um, what do you call that thing they give people when they Fresh. retire? Gratuity. Yeah. <laughs> Take this one. And mm -hmm. Why are you looking at me? This Congo woman is looking at me like. <laughs> I mean, anything to avoid bloodshed. Mm -hmm. Are you not a Congolese woman? Uh, anything to avoid bloodshed. Are you not in support of avoiding bloodshed? Yes. yes. Uh, if a woman will have work, you know, we we'll give we we'll give him another woman and say. <laughs> <laughs> Instead of a gold watch, you know, yes, give him a woman and say go. Uh, uh, feminist, please don't write me. This is I. I don't write this crap. This is the guy that wrote it. <laughs> I'm telling you, uh, they said I should say that. <laughs> this, is, this is something we call Secrets of Picture! It's based on the premise that a picture is worth more than a thousand. Where? Now, now, the first picture you're looking at is that of President Muhammadu Buhari hey. and the Secretary to the Federal Government mm. and the Head of Service. Wow. Oh, yeah, look at them, look at them, smile, laughing. <laughs> Buhari was shaking his hand and he was, Buhari was saying to him, I heard that um, you have a new title. Hey. <laughs> he said that you are now the secretary to the federal government and head of corruption services. Hey. <laughs> and the man laughed. <laughs> <laughs> then he discovered, oh, he wasn't funny. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, the second picture you're looking at is a picture of a flip-flop. Mm -hmm. Flip-flop. Yeah, you know, sale pass. Mm -hmm. Sale pass. Mm -hmm. You know, people tell me that there is a recession, but they have not been able to provide proof mm. until now. Look at that, look at that, look at that, look at that. Ah. This is 
an irrevocable proof that there is recession. Mm. You, you, you have you seen it? Look at it again. <laughs> this is recession. There's what? no doubt. No, no doubt what? about it. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God. Ah. Uh, these are the stories making headline news across Nigeria this week. Kenya fails to mark anti-corruption day as funds meant for the event go missing. <laughs> this is wonderful. I like Kenya. Their own is not, they, they couldn't mark anti-corruption day because the money got missing. So what is the use marking? No, I mean, corruption is well and alive. There's no need to mark it. It's alive. It's just, just. <laughs> ah, Kenya, Kenya, uh, they, they are second to Nigeria. <laughs> 2019, Atiku committed to APC. Hey. You know what they are saying? Yes. Atiku is saying that he is committed to APC. Mm. Didn't he say the same thing to his first wife? Mm. Then, then he married the second one, and he repeated the commitment. The he did the same thing for the third wife and the fourth wife. <laughs> so leave matter for Matthias. <laughs> Atiku is always committed until there is no need to commit again. Yes. <laughs> That's why I didn't commit anything. <laughs> Mamudoka knows I'm not committed mm. to anything. Yeah. <laughs> Ah, I have never collected salary as governor, says the governor of Washington State. Yeah. Are Are Bush, Shola. Yeah, he said he Rafi. has never collected Rafi. anything. Rafi. Rafi. Yeah, hey. no, no, no. This is, this is what I'm saying to people. Why will he need salary when he collects an average of 100 million a month as security vote? Uh, yes, now. Yes, Every now. month. Why? Why should you need a salary? Nonsense. That, that's not don't, a, don't, that's for. don't let them fool you. Don't mm. let them fool you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I used my office rent for MMM, e says media personality, Nobel Igwe. Hey. No, no, did I say he said he oh, cried, he cried out. <laughs> I'm like, hey, yeah, uh, don't worry, my friend. Hey, I'm, sh I'm, sh I'm sure, I'm sure there is a space under Echo Bridge, you know, where you can set up shop. Mm -hmm. For the time being, until January. <laughs> <laughs> until January, because they, they will come back in January. <laughs> Under the bridge, you find a space. Try. Mm. <laughs> Tell them to move for you, you know. Nonsense. <laughs> NUC to approve 150 new private universities by 2019. What? Did you hear that? 150 new private universities what? by 2019. Now, now, this is, this is the idea. They vow to continue to approve new universities until two things happen. One, until good Lord Jonathan becomes a professor somewhere. Hey. And, and the other thing that must happen, yeah, you took it, said no. The other thing that must happen before they stop approving private universities is that they want to make sure that Nigeria has more universities than all the branches of Redeemed Christian Church in Nigeria. Hey. That is the goal. There are too many branches of oh, this Redeemed quality. Christian Church. They want to make sure that Nigeria has more universities than Redeemed Churches. Mm, good idea. I don't blame them. I don't blame them. Yeah, because, I mean, we need more scientists than more pastors. Pastors just, they don't produce anything. Niger Delta leaders to Buhari, the boys have stopped bombing. Let's talk now. Hmm. They're telling Buhari that the boys, this is from Punch yes. newspaper, that the, I said something is wrong with this headline, Punch. This is, hmm. there's something is wrong. It is not the boys have stopped bombing. Hmm. The way to write it is our boys have stopped bombing. <laughs> Our boys, did you, did you get it? Because when you say the boys, it's like they don't know the boys, they don't have anything. Say, our boys have stopped bombing. <laughs> editors, editors, you cost one of this what? trouble. What? All this trouble that we have, you are part of the cause. Growing up in Kenya, my sister and I were very close. But like any sisters, we fought a lot. She always got new clothes, and I always got hand me downs. Now she's putting her children through school in Kenya. We still fight sometimes, especially when I send money for the kids. I tell her, buy some clothes for the younger one, and we both laugh. With nearly 500,000 locations, our app and online, this is moving money for better. <laughs> I'm back again. Yeah, I'm your back. <laughs> yeah. Wow. My, my name is Nosyam. Nosyam. I told you before. Nosyam, not pounded yam. My, my name is Nosyam. When are they going to Can pound you? Can you say yam? Yam. Yam. Say yam. 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 <laughs>
Yeah. Lost Damn, dog. Lost Damn. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. What, what happened? Do you just still sick? She's still sick. Oh. Right I, after I the tried, show last week. I tried to call her. She won't answer my call. Oh, really? What did I do? Right after the show last week, I yeah. visited her. She mm. was still sick. Very is, sick. Is this something you to need do? To visit something to do with? You need, no, no. I, you no? need to visit her. Is something to do? You need to visit her. Are you part of Are you part of it? She didn't tell you? No, she didn't. Are you part of the people that did? Ah, no, no. I no, 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 I'm no, coming no. to see you after this, after this show. I got the address. I'm coming to see you. All right. So do we have emails yeah, today? Yeah, every day, doctor. All right. Let, let's hear them, please. Yeah. Our first email is from Ahmed Aliu. He ah, writes. Ahmed is my friend. Yes. We used to eat suya. He, oh, he you know a way of eating suya, eh? He would put it in his mouth and then the stick ah, would just doctor, come out. The stick would just come out. You know, like, the stick would just... The blood is not coming out of <laughs> no, your mouth. The stick would just come out. All right. Let's, let's hear the email. Yes. Doctor, dear Doctor Damages, yes, man. I wish to commend you on the good work that you have been doing so far. We try. Please keep it up. Damn. Please kindly send your crack reporters to Malaysia, uh -uh. as the embassy are extorting us so bad. Uh -uh. We pay we pay huge sum of money for all passport related issues. After doing the online payment, they collect additional two hundred Malaysian ram. What? Which is equivalent to about 25,000 Nigerian naira. To fear what? For what? The funny part is that the receipt is issued online written in Chinese language. <laughs> I don't know when did Madrin turn into an, an official, official language. Nigerian language. What? <laughs> That's about it. Doctor. That's it? <laughs> Uh, I mean, I mean, thank you for bringing this up. You know, the situation in Nigerian embassies across the world, Nigerian embassies across the world, is pathetic. Hmm. Now, why nothing has been done about this is beyond me. Hmm. It's beyond me. Hmm. This, this is what I'm thinking, you know. I think it's time for Nigeria to close some of these embassies hmm. across the world. If we cannot fund them, we don't have money, hmm. we we'll just close them down and hmm. outsource the services to other countries. Uh, absolutely. It will make it cheaper and, and more efficient. Yes, yes, yes. In the meantime, this is what I think. All of you in Malaysia should just flood the email of the external affairs minister <laughs> and call him day and night mm. until he, he, he does something about this. Mm, you yes. have to do something. Yes. It's, it's, it's crazy. Yes, Not absolutely. just in Malaysia. Everywhere in the world. Even people are in complaining. New York. Even in New York. Even in New York. Yes. People are writing me complaining. Even in Canada. Even in Canada. Yes. What is yeah. wrong with us? Mm. Next. Yeah. Our second email is from Mustafa Musa. From Bonu, oh, from Bonu yeah, States, yeah, yeah, yeah. but he's based in Egypt, Cairo. I know, I know him. I know he him. writes, he's my friend, yes. Dear doctor, dear greatest, dear greatest doctor of all time. Hey, my I head saw is this swelling. video of one of your uh, senators from the north. Uh -huh. The first person that came to my mind is you. Uh -uh. It's yeah. your fault, doctor. Uh -uh. You have been sleeping, and this is happening in our national assembly. Please play this video. No ah, way. Oh, oh, ah. Okay, okay, stop, stop, stop. Mm. Oh yeah, oh, um, oh, okay, okay. please, please, please. Um, so, so this is my fault. Mm. Okay, I accept it's my fault. I will wake up. But first of all, the people who elected him should wake up first and do something. Mm. Once they start doing something, then I will send my crack reporters. That's true. That is how it works. Yes. We don't make the news. We make the news matter when we show up. Yes. You understand? Yes. That's how it works. <laughs> yes, doctor. It's no news yes, until doctor. my crack reporters are there. Yes. But you have to start doing something first before we come. Anyway, that's all the time we have for emails. Please keep sending your emails to Dr. Damages at gmail.com and follow us on Twitter at Dr. Damages. Now, here is my concern for today. It's taken from page 419 of the book Killing the Rising Sun by Mark Twain. Hmm. And it says, the two most important days in your life are the day that you are born mm -hmm. and the day that you find out why. Wow, that's beautiful. Yeah, that's that's deep. Yes. I go, deep, far, deep, I go deep, far to get it. Deep, Sometimes deep. I, re I repeat the one I use. <laughs> <laughs> Until next Don't week. Don't let your secret Until out. Until next week, I'm Dr. Damages. I diagnose you, you yourself. Woo! So, um, um, you know, I came back the second time, mm, doctor. Because they said, they said you did well. You, you should no, commend No, no, no. I, I got the report. They sent yes. me a report. They said yes. you did well. Yes, yes. There are all the things but, in our fridge. We can't me, find them I'm anymore. I'm costly. I'm costly. My money <laughs> is double double. I know. I know. My, the, I saw the check they I, sent to you. And I collect, and I, I collect I, this. I, I collect this too. I had that the fridge. Our fridge is empty. I'm, I'm a typical Nigerian. Uh, I don't know where they got you. I don't I'm know. I'm a typical Nigerian. I'm praying for tomorrow just to come back. Yeah, because 
doctor, will be broke doctor, at this rate. Adi, eh? this and one. I heard that they Adi, said this one this drunk, Adi, this, you, Adi, you are taking some Adi, some things Adi, when when you when you're have, on break. The one you eh? left when you're on break. The one you left this is a medical practice, so anyway. All right, you can go. We can go. Let's see what happens next week. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, please, I'm begging you. Can you go and watch more? They, they asked me to do this. Otherwise, there won't be, you know, things are hard. Watch, watch more. I, in fact, there's some way I'm cooking a goose. Subscri also, subscribe to the Sahara YouTube account. What is the name of the account again? Anyway, subscribe. Whatever they say, subscribe. Click on it. Please. <laughs> For me. For me. Nice. Thank you.